What is good YouTube, bro? It's your boy The Lost Reacts, and today I got another video for y'all. Today we got the Phoenix Suns taking on the LA Clippers, man. Los Angeles Clippers, game number. Oh, I'm gonna do my fingers. Game number six, right? Hey, man. You know what I'm saying? If you haven't heard already, you know what I'm saying? Chris Paul made it to his first NBA Finals, man. Congratulations, man. Well deserved, bro. I don't care if anybody says. Oh, the Lakers were injured, or the Nuggets was injured, or the Clips was injured, bro. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, bro, you know what I'm saying? Listen, bro, you deserve it, bro. We're not going to take that away from you ever. So, you know what I'm saying? Enjoy this moment, bro. But before we start the video, you know what I'm saying? If you haven't done so already, if you haven't done so, make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe to this channel if you're new. Don't forget to hit that post notification bell every time you drop me a video. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok links. They're down below. And I'm going to have this game down below as well. So, let's get into it, man. Alright. Man, that's crazy, man. Chris Paul in the finals, bro. I thought I'd never see the day, man. Mm, okay. The law. That's that's how like started off. Patrick Beverly, bitch ass. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? Honestly, like I'm not even mad. You know what I'm saying that I'm not even upset that I got my pick wrong. You know what I'm saying? Because I know I, I did pick the Clippers to go to the finals, but I don't give a fuck. Listen, man, the Suns deserve it, bro. For real, the Suns deserve it, man. Okay. I'm gonna look at the boss score in a little bit. Hell no. Mm. Chris Paul was going off his game, bro. 41 points, bro. Ah, crazy. I think he only missed one three pointer. All into that, bro. He made he made all of his threes, bro, which is wild. Hmm. Dude was on a mission, man. Um, oh, yeah. Hey, man. Um, shout out to Paul George. You know, even though he didn't play his best game in this, in game six, overall, this whole this whole postseason, really, hey, man, you gotta give this dude his credit. You gotta give him his flowers. He really played up to his, not potential, but, I mean, because we already know what he can do. He really, he, he was, he was, go he was balling. He was really balling this playoffs, and I got to give him his credit. I think he averaged, what, 29, 29 points, maybe 30 points this whole postseason. And what he, what he was able to do without Kawhi, keeping him in the series, being in the Jazz, the number one seed, the, the, the best team in the league, you know what I'm saying, beating them and then forcing the Suns to six games. You know, got to give him his credit. Can't call him, call, can't call him Pandemic P you know, more than that. Playoff P. From now on, so I gotta give him his respect. That was lucky. That was lucky. Man. Okay, good floater. And uh, shout out to Reggie Jackson, too, man. Give him his credit, he bought out this playoffs, too. Good shot. Okay. Let's see. For the Suns, let's see. Booker at 22 points, 7 and 4, 39% field goal wise. On the floor, 1 for 7 from the 3. Wasn't it this? Yeah, Devin Booker's been on in a little, but he's been on a little slump shooting wise. But at the end of the day, man, they won the game. So who gives a fuck? You know what I'm saying? But. Yeah, 26 attempts is crazy for 22 points, though. That's that's a little wild. But, like I said, man, he still won the game. Aiton did his, his thing. You know what I'm saying? 16 points, 17 rebounds, 8 for 10. 
One thing I noticed, they was going to eat early in the game, and then it's like stopped. I don't know why, but they won. You know what I'm saying? So fuck it. All right, there we go. Good shot. Let's see. Chris Paul, 41 points. 67% on the floor, man. And he shot 80, 87.5% from the three. Well, 88%. But he was just going crazy, man. Dude, just it looked like he just couldn't miss. Really. God damn. Beverly, man. God damn. Gold menace to society badge, bro. Like, fuck, man. <laughs> mm. Jay Crowder stepped up. 19 points for Crowder. 5 for 9 from the 3. So, yeah, Jay Crowder shot the ball well. Mm. Chris Paul mid range. Uh, can't stop it. Let's see, let's see. Okay. But yeah, Bench didn't really do much enough. Oh yeah, Tory Craig. He played great defense on um, on Paul George. That was pretty much the reason why Paul George really couldn't get into a rhythm. Because Tor Tory Craig was this he was pretty much disrupting things for disrupting things for Paul George, making life difficult really. So Paul George wasn't really able to get into a rhythm. So give Tory Craig his credit. Mm. Good shot. Okay. All right, so Clippers, I'm going to make this real quick. Paul George, 21 points. Not the best efficiency, 6 for 15. Didn't, he didn't even tap that many shots. Only only put up 15 shots. Made six of them. It was only one for six from the three. Reggie Jackson, not a, not his best game. 13 points. Four for 12. Not good. Let's see. Let's see. Morris had his Morris pretty much had his best game. Really, 20, 26 points. Nine for 17. Not not bad. Not bad at all. Let's see. Yeah, not, ball, not bad from, from Morris. Cousins has 12 points off the bench. It's not bad. Okay, I'll give him that. So. I know that, that was a little flop by Paul. So. Mm, good layup. But yeah, there's definitely some players on the Clippers that stepped up. Like uh, Paul George. Jackson, Marcus Morris, and, and at different times stepped up. You know, Cousins stepped up when needed to. So, yeah, definitely give the Clippers team, you know, their credit. They're definitely gonna be back next year with the addition of Kawhi back coming coming back from injury. So, yeah, the Clippers should be good. The Clippers should be good next year. So, okay. That that crossover was crazy. I'm not gonna lie. That crossover was crazy. Yep, that was crazy. And one. Hmm. Yeah, that was a bitch. That was a bitch move by Beverly, man. That was a bitch move, bro. Like, especially when like when he's not looking, bro. It, and it, I don't know if Chris Paul said anything to him before that happened, cause I know when you when 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 they're walking back, I know Chris Paul didn't say anything. So maybe he might have said something before. But other than that, bro, you don't push, bro. That's that's a bitch move, bro. I mean, he apologized, but I mean, I'm saying you could have you could have seriously hurt him, bro. Yeah, Chris Paul. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead, bro. Go off. This your moment, bro. And it's crazy, too, because he, he did it in the building he used to play for, which is wild, man. He used to play for the Clippers. Now, 
he beat the Clippers to go to the finals. <laughs> this is crazy, man. He said he was too old. He said he lost his step. He said he couldn't do no more, man. But, you know what I'm saying? Here he is right now in the NBA Finals, bro. So, hey, man. Shout out to Chris Paul, man. Uh, I really hope he really gets that ring, man. Really hope so. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of favoring the Suns. So, we'll see what happens in the hawks Bucks series. So, it's going to be real interesting to, to, to see. But, yeah, man. Tell me what y'all think. You know what I'm saying? How y'all feeling about the Suns going to the finals? You know what I'm saying? Y'all can leave your comments down below. If there's any other videos y'all want me to react to, comment section down below. Without further ado, I'm going to head out.